Hi, Kevin from Prickly Pear Camera here. Today we're gonna go over the 10 strangest photos I have ever seen in my 15 years of reselling digital cameras. I've come across thousands, tens of thousands of pictures in camera memory that I've ended up deleting. And these are the 10 strangest, most bizarre photos that I've encountered. Some are funny, some are strange, some are coincidences, and some are, ooh. Ugh. Oh, and I'm not including the actual pictures uh, because in many cases I don't have them because I've encountered these from a number of years ago or I wanted to protect the mostly innocent. Cat in the top hat. Can't quite do it justice, but it really resembled this photo. Oddly enough, the background was a Christmas tree, so perhaps this little cat wrote to Santa and the only thing on his list was a little bit of catnip and this sweet hat. Still brings a smile to my face when I think about it. It might be the only cute one on this list, so buckle up. Number nine, breath holding contest? Okay, this was very strange. There was a series of photos saved on the memory card in a camera that were of three different people, all with pursed lips, swollen cheeks, and incredibly red faces. It appears that they were either very heavy drinkers or were competing with each other in some sort of ad lib breath holding contest. Uh, or perhaps it was a red face contest? And whoever's face turned the darkest shade of red before passing out Juan? Not entirely sure what was going on here, but it was quite strange. Number eight, so many poops. As with many pictures and cameras that I get, this particular camera had pictures of a dog, which wasn't unusual, but it also had pictures of the owner's backyard, also not unusual, however, Said owner's backyard was full of poop. Just absolutely loaded. I don't know why there were so many individual pictures taken of various loads. It was just too much. After the 10th picture that showcased only stool, I had to stop. By that point, I'd gotten a good idea of what the dog's diet and health was, and I just had to end it. I ended up with a new respect for those dog poop picker-upper companies that I see advertised. What an awful job picking up crap every day. Number seven. This is a very odd coincidence. Uh, last summer, uh, I was about to embark on a fishing trip to Canada to fish for smallmouth bass, uh, northern pike, and a few other species, but the main target was smallmouth bass. Right before I left, I was going through pictures on a camera to delete, and the pictures had a bunch of fish on them. And the fish in question were also smallmouth bass. But these smallmouth bass where I kid you not, the biggest smallmouth bass that I've ever seen in my life. And I'm putting up an actual picture of the actual bass taken from the camera. And it is a monster. It looks like it's almost 10 pounds. Kind of long-armed, but still a giant fish. So before the trip, I was super excited and I was thinking, man, I want, we might get into a mongo bass like that. In the end, the average size of the bass that I caught was this. Still decent sized, but uh, gosh. Nothing close to that giant. Number six, weird Halloween costume. I've seen dozens, if not hundreds, of mostly cute Halloween outfits and pictures on cameras, but this one takes the cake for the strangest. It was a full grown man dressed up as some internal organ, I think, possibly a spleen. From what I recall, his compatriots were all dressed as normal-ish. Uh, Halloween outfits, but this was just bizarre. And to make it even more realistic, there seemed to have been like red food coloring. Number five, fingernail collection. Yes, you heard that right. Not for the squeamish. It actually brought me back to when I worked at a call center, starting out my career selling cameras 20 years ago, and my supervisor would trim his fingernails every day. I don't know how they grew that fast. He must have been eating, eating something that really made him grow. And it would always make my neck hair stand on end. There were a few pictures of this nail collection in the camera. And the most disturbing was a picture of the clear jar that the nails were stored in and the nails just falling out of the jar. I don't know how long this had been kept, why it was kept, but that memory still haunts me. Number four. Pet bush baby? So a bush baby, if you're not aware, 
Uh, kind of looks like a little monkey or tarsier. Uh, it's a little guy with really giant eyes. I don't think they're supposed to be kept as pets, but in the pictures that I was looking at, it was clearly a pet, and it had a little diaper on. And it's sad because I believe these are endangered, if not uh, protected. Um, but what made it strange was it <laughs> it brought back flashbacks to when I used to watch American Idol, and the the funniest both, moment and was, of American Idol for me was me when Simon Cowell commented that one of the American Idol contestants looked like a bush baby. What are you doing? And I was rolling on the floor laughing. Uh, <laughs> with the big eyes. Massive eyes. Oh my god. Oh my god. Number three, human maze. This was a series of images of a human going through a human sized maze, but the viewpoint. And the picture that was taken was showcasing a rat. A rat that was observing a human going through a human-sized maze. Was a human too kept in a cage and only let out for exercise to complete the maze? What sort of treats were involved if they completed the maze? Was there shock therapy? There's so many questions and so few answers. I wish I could elaborate more, but unfortunately the pictures ended there. Now we're getting into it. These last two are special. Number two, a giant of a man, really a young man, but very, very big young man, holding a very large weapon with a self-portrait of himself holding a different weapon right behind him and what appears to be his mother approvingly smiling right next to him. And a drum roll, please. The strangest, weirdest photo and photos that I've ever seen in my entire time of looking through thousands of cameras' pictures involves, I hate to say, armpits. You may ask, well, how are armpits weird? They're a little, little creepy sometimes, especially if they're moist. This was no regular armpit. This was a woman's armpit. Now, don't get me wrong. I have no issues with, with women growing armpit hair. But what made it truly disturbing was the armpit hair was braided. And the pictures that were taken were taken from multiple angles to showcase the quality of the braiding skills. Braided armpit hair. Once you see it, you can never unsee it. And those are the top 10 weirdest, strangest, creepiest pictures that I've ever seen. Please leave a like and subscribe. And let me know down below, what's the weirdest, strangest, creepiest photo that you've ever seen?